my name is Zena Berkey and welcome to my YouTube channel. In case you're new here, I'm Young Adult Fiction Author and today I'm doing something that I didn't think I would be doing again so soon, but here we are. I have an unplugged book box. Uh, this is entertaining to me at least because I thought I canceled my subscription. Um, I went online, I checked it out, I thought I had canceled, I did not. That's on me, 100% on me, but I absolutely loved my first unplugged book box. I did a comparison between unplugged book box and loot no, sorry, fairy loot. And I found that I was definitely more in love with the unplugged book box between the two. And I didn't mind then when I got the email saying it had shipped because that meant I ordered it. Um, and that means I get a second one. And so I haven't even read the one, the book from the first one just because it's, hasn't been very long and I've had like cheer comps and stuff going but I'm really excited to read that first book that I got it's called The Oasis um, and I'm excited to find out what's in here um, in case you haven't watched the last video I will link it here or here I don't I don't know which side it'll be on but it'll pop up I promise um, and you guys can like look back and see how those went and stuff this video isn't sponsored at all I literally just signed up because I saw info on Instagram and thought it would be cool however unplug book box feel free to contact me because I love your box I think it's fantastic I really love and support it um, I choose to get the young adult fiction book because I read mostly young adult fiction that's also what I write but you can get adult fiction as well so um, yeah let's go ahead and open this once again it says unplug to recharge sorry there's like tape there so it's glare and now let's take a look at the box oh oh my gosh there's like so much floofy straight away and i immediately see socks oh, i see socks why did i get so aggressive i apologize oh my gosh okay so ooh, forbidden love I don't know why I moved this around as though it were glittery. Okay, here's the thing. No, we're not taking a look at this. We're going to set it to the side. We might reference it, but I don't like things to be spoiled. But now I want to show you what is all inside of this one. Oh, gosh. I was like, I'm going to drop this. Look at that. I see floofy stuff. That looks like... Ooh, something smells good. I think there might be a candle again. I don't even know. I don't even know. Okay, we're going to have to move some of these flizzies aside, though, and take... Oh my gosh. Okay, where can I set these floofies? I'll toss them onto that. I have like a mailing packet in the ground and we'll toss them onto that so they're mostly contained because there are so many things in here, including this. Guys, look at that. Look at that. Oh my gosh, it's just like a fake flower, but it's gorgeous. Literally, go is it paper? It's like, I don't know. It's like good, like thicker metallic paper. Like I want to take like photos with this, like cute, right? I love this. I'm having a Beauty and the Beast moment. Okay, we're going to set that gently over some there, right there. Okay, now let's see what's next. Oh, lovely war cherry blossom and vintage Paris lotion bar. Sorry, guys. I keep getting really excited about things for like, it's a flower. Do you guys see that? Like, can you, can you see that? I'm trying to like make it shadow. Oh my gosh, it's a lotion bar. She just like rub it. Ooh, that's pretty. It's like scented without being like super in your face, but you literally just like rub it. And oh my gosh, I love this. Oh my goodness. It is so cute. It's in this like precious little tin. And it's, yeah, it's called Lovely War. Oh, it has real roses in it. Oh, that's what the red is. That's really cool. Okay, next, this is the item that I saw. Okay, we have so many floofy stuck to it. Hold on. They're reading socks. Ah! They're like super, super cute, just like adorable socks. And they're like tall, like a little bit tall. And I'm excited. And this is the time of year where I need this this like style of sock. Like we get cold and wet weather and so having good socks for my boots are great. And these are adorable. And I literally just want to curl up and read with these. I might have to read after this. I haven't started the book from last month like I said. And I'm going to need to pretty soon here. And who knows. Maybe I'll put those socks on and do it. Okay now we have this. I don't know what it is. Maybe a candle. It is. Oh, thus with a kiss, wine, poison, longing. What? Oh my gosh. Okay. I can like already smell it. I tried to smell it with the lid off. What is this scent? 
What is this scent? Oh my gosh, it's like heaven. And it look, they put glitter on the top. They know me. Like, what is this scent? It's like cherry. It's like cherry magic. That's the only way to describe it. But it literally says, thus with a kiss. And um, just so you guys, if in case you don't know the reference, um, what, what is it? In Romeo and Juliet, I think Ju Juliet's when you say it. Like, thus with a kiss I die. And she kisses Romeo and dies. Is that is that correct? I know it's from that scene. Like, the iconic scene and in their death, you know? I love this. I love this so much. Okay. Oh, what do we got here? We have the February 2020 photo challenge Forbidden Love. Okay. So on February 18th, you need a full unboxing photo. Currently making it. Check. Uh, February 19th, red themed Romeo and Juliet candle photo. I told you it was Romeo and Juliet. I knew it. Yes. I didn't fail at being a theater major this day. Um, and then February 20th, Parisian... Parisian inspired photo of the lovely war lotion bar. February 21st, purple and black photo of together we caught fire in rose decor. I think that's the name of the book. Sorry, I spoiled it. February 22nd, magical snitch braid. What? Wait. Just kidding. I threw it with the floofies. I threw it with the floofies. I knew it. Okay, it is a magical snitch from Harry Potter. But it's a bracelet. No, nope. there we go. It's kind of tangled. It's my fault though, not the bracelet's fault. Look at that. That is actually really, really cute. I'm not like a Potterhead at all, but this is really cute. Really adorable. I really like that. Okay, so let's see. February 22nd, Magical Snitch bracelet photo with unplugged box. February 23rd, Cozy Sock and Favorite Book photo. February 24th, Dark Unplugged March Theme Reveal Card Photo. Found it. Ooh, Know Your Limits. Guys, I kinda wanna stay subscribed. I'm gonna have to like think about it. I'm gonna have to like have a chat with my budget about it. But I'm really excited for these photo challenges and I'm definitely gonna be entering them. So stay tuned on social media to see all the things. In fact, I might actually wait to post this video until closer to then so I don't ruin surprises. But finally we have the book. Um, we'll go ahead and open it. I love that this book box, they cover it. They cover the book so you don't open the book box and immediately see it. It's like its own little moment. Oh, together we got fire. I don't know why, but I felt the need to whisper. Shut up, guys. It is literally an author signature again. So you're not just getting the book, you're actually getting the author signature and it's on like a sticker and um, you stick it inside your book and that is so cool. I'm not gonna lie though, I don't know which direction is up. I really don't. So we're just gonna make that up and if it's upside down or inside out or wrong way, then it just is. But that is really, really, really cool. Okay, I, oh, I was gonna read the whole thing, but I just wanna read the sentence on the back. It says, it wasn't a kiss so much as an, igni an ignition. The sun lost behind the moon, the white hot melt of flame and silver. It was the world flipped sideways, hitting us, tilting us, sorry, into chaos. Not gonna lie, I'm not a huge romance book reader. However, I am excited to support this author and to check out the book. I will definitely give it a read and share my thoughts on social media. Um, it's maybe not the style of book I would necessarily go for, but again, I wanna support the author and I'm excited. And like this whole book box was fantastic. I absolutely love it for sure. And like I said, I, I kinda wanna keep subscribing. I'm gonna have to really think about it, like I said. Um, oh gosh. I'm just excited though, I love these boxes. Okay, recapping everything that I received. We got the book that does come with an autograph. So freaking cool, like so cool. We have this candle that I'm obsessed with and I might go light right now. We have the lotion bar. Next we have the golden snitch bracelet. We have our cozy reading socks. We have some info things, including the photo challenge, which I love that they do that, and it's like a chance to win free stuff. And last but not least, the origin flower. I think this is my favorite part. Ew, I got 
I got a little slob around it. Um, all in all, though, definitely enjoyed this box. I don't think I liked it quite as much as last month just because this one is more of, like, a romance theme. And I'm not, like, a super, like, romance book and movie kind of girl. Like... I don't know it's just me I watch movies with like action and explosions and all that like my sister and I refer to our style as liking guy movies because like we've gone to see movies where the only girls that are there besides us are like clearly with their boyfriends or their group of guy friends so yeah that's just where we are um so I would definitely say I give this box like either an 8 out of 10 or a 9 out of 10 maybe like an 8.5 out of 10 just because it's not some it's not like a specific theme to me that like really calls out to me but like again I'm like I don't celebrate Valentine's Day I don't really care for this month because of Valentine's Day that kind of stuff um but I'm obsessed with this rose I'm obsessed with the candle I'm just really excited for the items overall and they're definitely like really really high quality items like this isn't just like some like ooh like lotion you can go to like the dollar store and buy like this is like seriously like legit good lotion and like this candle I didn't read it out loud but it does say like it's a soy candle so these are like quality items that you're getting plus a book that has an autograph signature and all this so I definitely support it all the way but let me know your guys' thoughts at home though if you guys have enjoyed this video first of all give it a thumbs up then comment below your thoughts on the book in general and then also what's your what would be your favorite item if you got this books this books, this box with the book in it. Um, I am obsessed with this flower. I've said that a hundred times, but I also am really, really excited for the scent of this candle and just using this um, lotion bar as well. Plus, of course, the socks are going to be fuzzy. I'm a little on the fence about the book just because it's not my style of reading I normally would do, but like all in all, I'm still really excited overall about this box for sure. So let me know your favorite item or what you wish you would have gotten if you had gotten this box or if you did receive the box, what was your favorite item that you got? Uh, finally, make sure you're subscribed to my channel with notifications on so you find out as soon as new videos are posted i don't know if i'm gonna resubscribe to bookbox sorry unplugged bookbox or not i might i'm leaning towards doing like one more month and then we'll see from there we'll say that i'll do one more month probably oh this is such a hard decision let me know in the comments too if you think i should do one more month like i'm really on the fence i'm like really on the fence because i don't want to spend the full amount of money but I also really love these boxes. So I'm totally on the fence. But anyway, um, Unplugged Book Box, thank you so much for curating this amazing box, for making it available for people, for supporting authors in the young adult fiction realm. Um, I definitely love these boxes. I have, this is again my second one. I've definitely enjoyed both of them so much. Um, so thank you. And again, if you guys wanna like collab, call me, cause like I'm down. I love your product. Um, but for everyone else, thank you all so, so much for watching and I'll see you soon.